Um, okay, this is my first video. Um, hi. Uh, for people who know me on Tumblr, I'm the mischief artist, but, uh, my name is Chelsea. And right here I'm working on, um, a picture of Milton from Walk The Walking Dead, uh, which is, like, one of my favorite shows. Um, I, during the summer I did this in, uh, Herschel. And I didn't record Herschel because I didn't have enough time, but I did get to record some of uh, Milton. My camera decided to cut off, though, when I was coloring him, so I didn't get the full coloring, but I did get the full inking. Um, I will put in a link, I'll put in a link below, though, for the, um, to see the finished piece because I don't think I have the skin anymore, but I have it uploaded on my Tumblr. Um... Okay, I guess I'll talk about my process since I have like six minutes. <laughs> um, I oh, I am also sorry about my camera angle. Um, I just did a video today where I switched the position of my camera so you can actually see what I'm doing. Um, this one you can barely you can see, but there's some parts that are like covered by my hand, which is really annoying. <laughs> but anyway, um. My process is basically I um I get a piece of Strathmore uh, multimedia paper, and um I usually draw out my uh the portrait that I want to do with an H pencil or an F pencil. I like the F because it's a easy medium between H and um and B. It's like it's not too hard. It's not too soft. So that's usually what I my go to pencil, but. I do that and then um what I do is I um put some walnut ink over top of the sketch. So I try to clean up the sketch as much as possible and then I go over top of it with walnut ink and I let it dry overnight so that the tones can sit where they need to sit. Then I come in with a brush pen. In this video I'm using Prismacolor brush pen and I just Go over the lines and make sure I get all the lines that I want to keep in the piece. Um, I think right now in the recording I'm working with the watercolor, which you're gonna barely see in this video because it literally cut off. I think in the middle of it, but um, I used because I didn't have that many uh, copy markers. I did um, I did use watercolor to substitute for the colors that I needed. So a lot of the hair and the eyes and the um, shirt was done with watercolor and then the skin was done with uh, Copic. So I had to learn how to make it look like it was one cohesive piece without having, without um, using too much ink or using too much of my watercolor. Man, I talk way too fast. <laughs> um, I hate talking. <laughs> anyway, um... I can't think of anything else that I that's anything different about this piece. I think the only thing that sucks is I did this um I did a a blood pattern on top and it was really cool how I did it and I wish I got that recorded. <laughs> but um I didn't because my camera was being dumb. Um so yeah, I think it's getting to the end. I'm not really sure. Um, trying to think of something else to say. Uh, there's more to come for me. Uh, I am working on a Michonne piece. I just got the line art done today, and it's recorded, and I gotta just do the audio for that, which hopefully I can think of things to say other than my process. Like, why do I want to draw that character such and such? Um, I also have a star, a Star Lord, um, for Guardians of the Galaxy pin up to do, which will be fun. I'm gonna ink it off camera, but I'm gonna color, I'm gonna try to color it on camera, hopefully. Um, and I don't know, I have something else, but I can't really think of anything. So, um, yeah, uh, it's gonna be more audio because of the fact that I don't have any music, so, um. Hopefully I can think of more things and yeah, I hope you enjoy watching my video. Um.
and yep there's more to come so bye that's the worst ending ever um i see you guys around <laughs>